Welcome back, everybody, to the 27th episode here on the Mod Croc Guard campaign. And I hope this time my game does not crash. So I had to kind of do some things off stream, and I feel like I did as close as to where we were last time. Uh, so I didn't kind of get a different setting or, you know, kind of get a different playthrough. So I tried to still do, to be honest with you, right, but just putting it out there with my game crashing in the last episode. Uh, I tried to put it out there as much as I could uh, to keep the current uh, status, right? Uh, we are going to move into ambush stance here. We are going to... Uh, where is that thing to help ambushes? Right there. Give yourself a little bit more ambush chance just in case they come out. They're not going to because they don't actually have an army. Uh, but you will move in there. Perfect. Crocky, we're going to get you out here. But we're we're going to put you into uh, heal stance only because you'll be taking the dark hold next. And then we're going to give Mount Greyhag to Emric. Slowly build Emric up. Um, Mount Greyhag to Emric. I will not fail. Perfect. I've been giving you so much, bud. Can you just come back to life? All right, Arachatrol. Uh, do I? I think I do. Just go for Fortress of Fortress of Vorag right now. Oh, yeah. Woo, that's going to be a good one. That is going to be a good one. Do I want to just fight it? Let's see if I can... Uh... I mean, here's the thing. It's been a while since I've actually had a good fight. I can't get that. What do I have active right now, actually? All right. So, text delivery, protection. I'm about to attack. Oh, when attacking, I can't do that one. Accuracy, the storm. I mean, I, oh, it came to that. Man. Cooldown to all spells, vigor loss, fire reduction. Ward save. I guess we'll just wait then. Lame. Um, I could wait one turn to truly, to truly fight him. Take a little bit of attrition. Oxyadal. Where are you? Oh, that's right. I think we attacked it. Yeah, so we'll do that. I'm gonna lose that many people. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Well, let's do this then. Cause I think I sacked it last time and now I'm gonna lose that many people. So I hope they don't heal, which they shouldn't. Wait, what am I saying? It's the computer, of course they will. So I'm gonna heal one turn, then I should have enough to auto resolve and not have to lose any. How many settlements in here? So they still have four settlements here. You're going good here. I'm, I'm probably getting really close to confederating tic-tac-toe, uh, if I'm being honest. They're not gonna make it. Are you gonna attack Skull Carver's abode? You should. Let's go here. Can you do anything? I don't wanna hinder replenishment. Uh, good for now. Okay. Uh, Quahexla, what are you doing here, buddy? Yeah, we already beat back Ikit. He beat back another army. They're making one here. You... In one turn. So you should go in here. I don't think they're going to come after you. And if they do, that would be not smart on their part. Uh, in one turn, I'm going to get a lot more defenses, so that's going to help out. Get him healed up. You are going to have one turn for him. Okay. Uh, you have four units in there. I don't need you. What do I need? I have a Skink Oracle that's going to come back from being hurt. Uh, I probably should need. I probably do need one more infantry. Three of those. Oh, yeah, yeah. And I need two more... Two more flyers and then my skink oracle. Perfect. All right. Nakai the Wanderer. Let's go ahead and take this army out. I don't like it being there. You're going to run. That's totally fine. 
Let's go here. Boom. You're dead. Uh, heal, just to make sure we're healing. Then, let's force march down here. We're gonna go towards the Shinhal Monolith. And then we'll come back for the Demon's Gate. Uh, perform better in battle. For sure. Mount Gain Carnosaur, Mothlon's Blessing. Ooh. Physical resistance for 10. Oh my gosh. Oh wait, are you gonna go after that? Oh, well, if you go after that, I don't need to worry about it. Oh my gosh. Look at that. I want to confederate you and take all of those. So you're healing for a little bit. Tuzida, Crocky, uh, Arakataral. You got your healing one turn. You, I don't really know what you're doing here for now. Quahexla, Assassin, Grawl. Oops. Grawl. I did not move you. Uh, let's do, I guess, Mon Montinas. We'll see what's there. Oh, they have a little, they have a little decent army, huh? Got it, got it. They don't, I mean, they don't have any range. They have no, they have no range. These doom wheels are nothing. We should probably fight this real fast, actually. Let's go here to Banner of the Internal Flame. Put that on one of these guys. Scarecrow Banner, probably on here. Uh, you guys will probably be able to take them. Not to mention, we have our our uh, riders. Perfect. All right. Let's go ahead and have Grawwall face Compule the Warpsmith. Yeah. Take a hold of them. I feel like that's what he said. I could be wrong, but I'm just going out of limb here. Grawwall's army facing down some Skaven here. Look at him. Look at these little filthy rats. They don't know what's coming for them. They don't know what's coming for them. Waiting behind them, though, invisible, because they have stock, is my Chameleon Skink Stalkers. Grawwall's new army here. In the, in the trees, we have our Skink Colchin Riders come up the other side. We have our Soros Horn ones. And we have our single unit of, of Air Force, our Pterodon Riders. Going after one of the only couple, ra they have a couple range units back here, so we're trying to see if I can kind of weaken them and get them down. Obviously with multiple, and it's just one of them, it's not gonna do very good. But what's happening is my artillery is getting a lot of free shots in. So that's good. A lot of free shots in. We have our Zatul, Kowadl, right? A couple Soros Scar veterans. And then Grawwall himself, ready to charge in. We have our Bastilladon with solar engines are ready to get after it. Obviously, they dropped the spell resistance on me that if they drop spells, it's not going to be good. Summoning in some uh, clan rats here, but we're going to go ahead and move up. That way, the clan rats then just fall on the source line. Uh, running off my air force, not a good situation, but the closer they get over here, I'm going to bring out my, my skink. Uh, Colchin Riders. Look at them. Devastating charge. Devastating. Uh, up on the hill, though, they're going to go after my my Horned Ones. Not not a good situation for this Doom Flare. And then, watch this, rear, watch this charge. Oh, what? You tried to come after me? Oh my gosh. Literally deleted. Deleted. In the first charge. Uh, this, these horned ones will take out that doom wheel just fine. We're going to get another charge in. A lot better of a charge, but look at them. Like, they're just getting eaten up. So, these horned one riders are absolutely good for just demolishing Skaven. Here, we have our, our leadership going after an assassin of theirs. We got to make sure that this assassin, Mika, is taken care of. Because Mika will come over here and do a lot of damage. So we to make sure it's taken care of. But with the Carnosaur of Grawwall, uh, with the Doom Flare, Doom Wheels and all that, we should do okay over here. 
On the other flank, our Colchin Riders are taking out as many as they can. These are some fun, weird units. Overall, though, the Colchin Riders are going to knock out these Night Runners with slings. We're going to make sure we run them down, bring back our Air Force to help provide a little bit more support. The Master Assassin Compule right here, we need to take care of him. He's going to get some easy kills without doing anything. Colchin Riders are going to go after the fleeing Gutter Runners. And we have both Horned One Riders that have taken out Warp Grinders, taken out the Clan Rats of Spears, and the Death Bomb, Death Glow Bombardiers. Look at this big pile of mess right here. Our leadership, ooh, with some nice fire from our Bastilladons with solar engines. The Grudge Throwers are still getting in their kills. The Chameleon Skink Stalkers are here to help out. Sore Scar Veterans running down anybody fleeing. And all in all, everybody is absolutely getting deleted. Grawl Wall is going to go ahead and take out uh, Mika and the Doom Will single-handedly, I'm guessing. We're going to bring our Saurus old, our Horned Ones to kind of help run down any random units that are still hanging on. The Skaven leadership is still active. So we do still have the Warlock Engineer still going, uh, as, as well as the Assassin over here. But look at the kills we've racked up so far. 129, 144, 94, 47, but they did, he did get kind of held up with some Clan Rats. The Saurus are going to take care of this do Warp Fire Doom Wheel. Easy. The Zot Tool dropping some heals, helping take out the Doom Wheel. And all in all, I think it's safe to say that the Skaven fall to Grawwall. Even better. All right. I mean, against the Skaven, my. Uh, uh, Colchin Riders and the Horned Ones were just invaluable. Invaluable. Just ran them down. Got lots of kills. My ranged effort kept them at bay. They didn't have any range that I needed to deal with. And my leadership took care of the rest. Excellent. Uh, it is, it is going to be mine, so I'm just going to go ahead and take it. Revealed. Yes. Yes. Okay. What level are they? 25. Oh, wait, 18. That means they got their Carnosaur now. Oh gosh, you guys. I'm telling you, when I'm just when I'm just firing on all cylinders, I am firing on all cylinders. Uh, weapon or enchanted item. Uh, let's do potion of strength then for you. Can you get an Indian Cillaries? Uh, you can get um, that one and that one. Perfect. Uh, let's go ahead and put you a little more thick skinned. I like it. You have your Carnosaur as well, am I right? Yes, you do. Can you get anything? Nope. Talisman. Uh, do I want to be spell resistance? Armor. Uh, I like that there. That's perfect. Awesome. All right, let's go ahead and give you your ability. Oh, Blade Master. Yeah, make you a little bit better of a fighter. Or stronger of a fighter, rather. Life Bloom. Uh, probably when I'm casting everything and earth blood that's what replenishes yep let's do that that sounds good grawl wall you got yourself a nice little army here uh especially when fighting skaven you see that <laughs> yeah bud uh what do i need though i do need more so leadership is good infantry is good i have my speed maybe a few more flyers yeah, let's get two more flyers in there. Perfect. And then that should kind of just round out the army or at least make it uh, pretty sustainable for a while. Uh, Nakai the Wonderer, uh, you need to get... Uh, actually, what do you need to get? You pretty much have everything. Oh, melee defense. Let's get that up. Your Scar Veteran, th those are pretty easy. Your other Scar Veteran, again, pretty easy. Who are you, Skink Oracle? 
Primeval Roar, Susane, Leadership Wars size. Uh, you will be in melee combat, so let's put you in there. And uh, Protector of Life, yes. Awaken the Wood, excellent. Perfect, so you're good for now. To Zeta, you're gonna attack next turn. Krakar is good. A racket. Oh yeah, we have another fight. Fortress of Vorag. Uh, or was I gonna wait a turn? I might wait a turn. If they come out after me, that's not gonna be good for them. I have every every superiority. We do need to knock out that Hell Cannon though. That Hell Cannon is gonna provide lots of distractions for us. But other than that, uh, we're gonna absolutely ride them down. So if yeah 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 yeah, what I'll do is I'll wait one turn. I don't see an army that can reach us they're they're trying to heal up they're gonna lose another one they're gonna lose fortress of Borag. so one two three four five six and they're gonna lose that seven so they should have seven settlements left right perfect yep they have seven war coordination we'll go we'll hold off on that uh who needs skill points oh a skink chief well we need to make you uh, bottomless quiver from range, right? Maybe a little speed. Yeah, make you a little faster. That would help out. Hero not moved all the way down here. What are you going to do, my fr my friend? Can you do anything here? No, that's Cairo. So let's just move this way anyway. Skill points on more people. Uh, well, let's get the skink oracle there. All right. Ooh, Temple of Gold. Yes, please. I took a lot of money. A lot, a lot of money. Uh, yeah, I mean, I think the rest of these places are pretty well satisfied. We're going to go ahead and get them another level up there with my Skink Favelas. Into the Croxagord Labor District, right? And anything else? Oh, let's move that up to the kilns still have some more money what well, tabaro needs leveled up that's for sure haunted forest nothing in there ashridge mountains sump pit should i go ahead and give sump pit to emrick uh i feel like i should maybe i should wait one turn i have a lot to give to emrick actually so let's go ahead and give him sump pit yeah, I'm going to bleed you dry of money. I'm going to save it for next turn when you should be able to give me more. Uh, do I want to do... I don't think I do because I'm going to be friends with them soon. Or I'm going to confederate them soon. 19? Yeah, I think it's happening. It's probably going to happen in the next turn or two, if I'm being honest with you guys. So let's go all the way down here. I think we're good there. Quick deals. Anyone want to be my friend and do a deal with me? Do a little deal. You may look upon me. Make a little love. Get down tonight. Get down tonight. Outpost available. We're gonna wait. Uh, all right. Can I? Man, I really want to have that. I really want to have that summon of feral cold ones. That summon of the feral cold one is going to be absolutely invaluable, especially next turn. Next turn when we go against the um, the uh, chaos dwarves there, and the fortress of Vorag. Uh, no, I mean, how much does how much does Crooked Moon even have left? I just don't want to. I just don't want to have to go to another war somewhere right now. But I think Crooked Moon's getting beat out. If I'm being honest. They were they were a powerhouse for a while, but I think they're slowly getting chipped away by everybody. That's too bad. Sucks to suck, nerd. As I always say. I mean, we're almost done with Zinch, to be honest with you. They didn't end up taking it down there. So we gotta go back to the Demon's Gate. Take out that. And then keep working our way back um i'm sure martek lash it coffer perfect so close so close yet so far away uh ally missions what do you had what do you have for me uh, i'm actually gonna take him out with nakai so that's perfect does anybody else have an ally mission that i can do no okay outpost available 
Flayed rock. No, no. Scrap tower, desolation of gas, green god, novel gorge, just sentinel. Yeah, I'm gonna wait until one of these actually gets like leveled up. You know, they should be able to. Is that Emmerich? Yeah, Emmerich, come on. Like, take out Spite Peak, right? I mean, how much do they have left? They gotta have hardly anything left. <laughs> yeah, look at them moving in, moving in over here. Man, are we gonna have to go to war with them soon? I don't want to. Too many, too many fighting. Too much fighting. Can we just live a peaceful life, everyone? Just, just a peaceful life. All right. Croc got go in here and take Dark Hold. Perfect. Uh, yep. Ocu loot and occupy. It's mine, but I will be giving it to Imric. Uh, where is, where is Draz Hoif? That's interesting. I don't see Draz Hoif. Do I have everything unlocked? Why am I still getting points? Oh, mentor. Okay. Lord Croak. Growth. I think I. I mean, except for Deliverance of Eats at level one, so I might as well do that. All right. So they're healing. Arachatrol. Where? This is interesting. It took a little bit of damage. Peric victory. I mean, I'm not gonna lose anybody, but I think you want to see a fight probably. I kind of wanted them to sally out after me. It worries me now. Where did that army go? Ooh, did they lose it? Did, did they lose? Did Draz Hoth lose his army? Let's go here and take Pig Barter. Maybe if I get closer, I can see him. Oh, that's interesting. I'll just occupy it. Ah, oh, there's it's still there. Okay, good, good, good. Draz Holith's army is still there. So that being said, let's go ahead and take Fortress of Orag. And I guess we're gonna fight this then. They wanna fight in the settlement. Oh, oh hold on, hold on. Can I get him now? Oh, come on, man. Vigor loss. We'll do that. We'll do fire resistance because reasons. Dang. Alright, well. All right, I guess I'll have to fight it without the ability to summon the Feral Cold Ones on this Hell Cannon. So that's going to be tough. But let's we'll see what happens. See you in the battlefield. Oh, a settlement battle with the Chaos Dwarves. Wait, that's not Chaos Dwarves. Who is this? Oh, yeah, that's Hobgoblins. Duh. I was like, with the green skins. No, yeah, that confused me for a second. Uh, but yeah, with the Chaos Dwarves here. Uh, they're going to be a decent little army to kind of stop and to fight. However, how we have our settlements, or our garrison, our units, geez, uh, split up. Our air force is over here. Uh, going to make their way to the side. These towers are just absolutely deleted. My Sister of Avalorn unit, that's unfortunate. My Bastilla Dial Solar Engines and my Grudge Throwers are going to take out their towers as quick as they can. We're going to have my Soros units scale the walls. Leadership break open the gates as always our invisible chameleon skink stalkers are going to scale the wall and take out some of their must supply locations rather quickly here we have our air force getting some free shots in and a chaos dwarf warriors and the chaos blunder chaos dwarf dwarf blunderbuss leadership is in the settlement now we have our coaddle we have our sword scar veterans We have Arak, uh, Arak Taral as well in there. These uh, bull centaur renders are going to be absolutely tough to take out, so we got to make sure we're on them. If they were on their Carnosaur, it'd be a completely different story, but they're not, unfortunately. So we're going to make sure the Kawada goes after anyone fleeing. Get some free shots in here. Saurus scale in the walls. We do have 
our Croxagores and our Skink Oracle coming in here with well, some source units to help take out their blobs here in the front gate. Get him, Oracle. Whoa. Why are we getting some shots in here from the Hobgoblins? Kawaddle, can you get over and take care of this, please? Thank you. Appreciate you. Our Source Guard Vestions are getting surrounded by the Chaos Warriors, the Vol Centaur Renders. So we got to make sure we focus them down a little bit more. There is a priest up here. Uh, oh, well, Demon Smith Sorcerer, not a priest, but a Sorcerer of Hashut, casting some spells. So we got to take care of him. And what better way to take care of him, of him than getting our Sisters of Avalorn up here and let them take some magical arrows to the face. Now, we do have our Bastilladon, the Solar Engines, and our Grudge Throwers taking out the Fort Wall. Because we do have these units back here that are trying to fire on us. So if we can bring in our Bastilladon, the Solar Engines, just to kind of take care of some of these back, one, back units, uh, that'll help out tremendously. All in all, our units are winning the fight, especially with our leadership down there just... Just providing a significant leadership bonuses and, and additional bonuses to the fight. Up in the hill. Up in the hills, we do have our Chameleon Skin Stalkers that are that are ra getting to the higher ground. Getting to the main settlement up here. What I have one of them going to do is taking out this Hell Cannon. This Hell Cannon's already got 17 damage on us. And in blobs, that Hell Cannon will do a lot of damage. So we don't make sure we take care of that. Some of the units are trying to flee. But we do have our Bastilladon of the Solar Engines moving in. Trying to bring out everyone that we have. Our Source Scar Veterans got absolutely slapped around a little bit. They're about a quarter HP. Our Skink Oracle's still sitting pretty good, though. So Skink Oracle's going to go over there and do some damage. Uh, our Rakhtarol is going to do some damage as well. The Kawaddle is getting rid of anyone that is fleeing away. Source Scar Veterans and Croxagores did a great job cleaning up the gates. Here is this Demon Smith Sorcerer. We are going to position our Sisters of Avalorn uh, there to attack him. He's just going to stand there the whole time. And that's going to be a big mistake. Big mistake. Are you guys scared? Run with your shields up. Uh-oh. I would be scared of that. That's got to hurt. Look at these two dinos that are just staring you down in the face. It's, that's got to hurt. Did they get blinded? They got poisoned, not blinded. Skink Oracle over here taking out a unit of Hobgoblin Archers. That'll be an easy win for the Skink Oracle. And here we have our... But still Adonis with solar engines getting into the battle. I mean, you're armored. You got a big horn on your head. You got a big tail swinging. You're going to dominate them. That's why I love Lizardmen. You just get big dinos here attacking people, eating them, throwing them around. It's amazing. You see in the background the Sisters of Avalorn. Look, how, how do you survive this? These magical arrows are just deleting him. Already down to less than half HP. The Kowaddle's running off any any units that are hanging around. The Chameleon Skink Stalkers are going to take out the Hobgoblin Cutthroats because the Hell Cannon is already done for. The final Skink Chameleon Skink unit is taking the main settlement. But that's it. The Chaos Dwarves could not hang with a Rakatar roll. I'll get it right one of these times. <laughs> Man, those towers kind of ripped me apart. Especially one of my Sisters of Avalorn units. Sorry about ya. But we absolutely took the settlement. And uh, for sure going to sack it. Then take it because we are going to give it to Emmerich. So now we're going to go ahead and occupy it. We're going to get that nice healing. Ah, it's not the greatest healing, I will say. But it is healing nonetheless. They're not going to make oh, me in a turn or two. Uh, I'll be able to move them out as well. So, uh, yeah. He is absolutely... He just lost three settlements in one turn. So... 
he's not sure what to do right now, and I don't think he I don't think he wants a piece of this. Okay, where are we gonna go? What are we gonna do? I mean, you just got a basic army. I'm probably gonna upgrade you at some point. But for right now, let's just make you a little, a little bit better of a fighter. Your skink oracle a little bit. Oh. Let's get that roar, baby. Okay, oops. Let's go back. You guys have a bunch of skill points to add up. Two skill points. Um, is your Saurus up? And is your Flyers up? That's what I want to know. Your Saurus is not up. So you have Saurus line that you, want, you need to take care of. Skink Oracle. You need to make sure you're a little bit stronger. Yes, you have your Carnosaurs now. Uh, do you not have anything equipable? Um, what? Oh, yeah, nothing. Yeah, nothing you don't have already. Perfect. Okay. Uh, well, let's go ahead and give you the things that you need. Missile resistance as well. These are things that you need, so we might as well just give them to you now. Oh, mounted. Oh, I should have done that because we're on a Carnosaur, so. Oh, well. <laughs> Uh, that does not, that one doesn't work. All right. So they, oh, of course they're almost back to full, full health now. They heal a lot faster than any other unit does. Perfect. Okay. We'll take, we'll take that one less settlement for them to worry about. Uh, you know, okay healing. I wouldn't say it's the best. It is okay healing. Oh, they did take Skull Carver's Abode. So does that mean you're ready to confederate? No, of course not. Why would you be? Why would you be? You just got owned here. I thought you were down here helping. They took all of these back. Like, what are you... Oh, wait, hold on. Just that one. Voltrex here. What are you doing? Oh, are you going to attack? Nice. Yes, go after him. What are you doing? Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go through the demon gates. So don't you worry. Uh, I'm gonna go into wait one more turn because I do heal in the water. Uh, can I take out the sea? There, the sea attrition. Not that, not that I was getting it anyway. Oh, there they are. You cannot deceive the deceiver. Veritix, can I? I can, I can. I can actually attack you right now. Let's go. We'll knock out that army automatically. Get a little bit of healing here. Do I have any healing out there? That's actually pretty decent healing. If I do say so myself. Should I get spawned of eats? No, I don't need to do that at all. At all. Uh, we, what we need to do is work on this line. So let's give you a little ambush success chance. Let's go here. What level are you? You have your Carnosaur. Excellent. Blade shield for sure. Quarter of life. Ooh, dwellers below. That sounds fun. Causes severe damage to combatants. Well... Since you used the word severe, I will take your word for it. I get weapon strength up and my other, my second Sore Scar Veteran. Let's give you Deadly Onslaught. Perfect. Uh, that's actually pretty decent healing uh, when we go into the next turn. I will be able to take out Demon's Gate, hopefully next turn. We will see. Grawl wall one more turn, and then you're gonna be able to take out Bilboa. Pig Barter, Tuzita, Krakar, Rack. Gosh, guys, can we just stop leveling up so much? Jeez. You guys are absolutely cracked. What do I need from you? Maybe speed? No. Piercing shots? No. What do you have? You have some chameleons. Did I? I hopefully have all unbelievable. You don't even have like your people that you're good at leveled up. What's the AI? What is the AI? Do? Honored Elder for sure. What's the AI do? You know? Like they just don't pick the right ones, I feel. 
I feel like they don't. Let's do specialist down here. Uh, skink Oracle. Let's get you the roar. All right. You need to heal a little bit. Uh, that would be lovely if you did. Uh, two turns. I mean, 115. Is money really that big of a thing right here? I kind of just want to get rid of all of this down here. Look at I'm not going to be able to actually use any of this, so. But it is it's neither here nor there. You need to heal up a little bit faster. You, can you do anything with this army here? Hinder replenishment? No. Okay. Uh, well, just move over here. That way you can make sure that no one attacks my flank. Aha! They are running like little scaredy cats. Why am I not healing inside of my own territory? There we go. Should help out. How we got doing here? So, I mean, I just, I love, love it. Love it. One turn, then the assassin's going to be able to help out again. Nakai, Grawwall's one turn. Okay, I feel like we're doing everything that we can. Now, let's go to some of our settlements. Can our settlements level up at all? Well, obviously for money, for sure. Okay, pig barter, uh, dark hold. Uh, I just took this, right? Yeah, dark hold. Vor Vorag, I'm gonna get rid of it anyway. I still don't know where I can get this. I'm t I'm dumb. Jeez. Oh my god. That's why I'm like, where can I get this guy? But Skink Oracle, Skink Priest, Croxagore Elder. Here we go. I wanna see I wanna see this guy in action. Um uh, alright. So magic drop chance. Let's do discipline, I guess. Look at this hero. Gorte! I don't even know who needs a Croxagore Elder. Who need who needs a hero? Another one. Iraq, you're good. I mean, you're good. Unless, like, I don't know. I don't want to get rid of anybody. This army's been with it with it since the beginning. Maybe bring you over here to, to Zeta. But at the same time, what do I... I don't have any armies over here. Anybody down here? Okay. Okay. You guys are going... You guys are doing good. Hopefully, they're going after Spite Peak. Uh, they're pushing up. They're pushing up. Uh, you don't have anybody over here, so I guess you're going. To, you're going to go to Tazita's army. So let's go there. Level up. What can I? Crux, look at this guy. <laughs> look at this guy, man. Oh my God. Ward save. Miscast chance. I'll get you an armor. I mean, I'm all. I'm already on board. Predator fighter. I don't know what any of these are, but I love it, and I want it, and I'm here for it. All right, finally got a Croxagore Elder in our midst. Oh, yeah, I didn't even finish doing this. Okay, what can I get here with Kimri? I mean, I might as well just do this, just just because I, ha I can, and I have the money. Pl chance of Plague spreading, under cities... I guess maybe this for research rate. At this point, why not? Sudenberg. I feel like all the rest of my settlements are doing part to good. Nothing truly being able to be leveled up right now. Okay, I think we're set. Yep, we'll get rid of. We'll give all that to Emmerich next turn. Uh, I mean, I might as well. Building upgrade. Where? I might as well. We're just getting all kinds of money. Outpost available. Oh, I can I can actually build an outpost and get sacred croxagores from you? That's interesting. I'm just kind of checking to see what all I can get from them. Hmm. That's interesting. Zlatland. Might as well just construct it there, right? Even though you're going to confederate soon, aren't you, bud? I feel it. I feel it deep in my bones. Deep in my loins. Okay. Let's go here and turn. Deep in my loins, I feel it, I tell ya. 
Oh no! Are you trying to be my friend? <laughs> oh god, that's funny. Chat, do you remember all the heartaches and all the headaches and all the frustration that Zinch gave me and now that I finally have them on their heels and now they want to be friends with me? <laughs> oh god. I've never heard such a good joke in my life. Ever. Where are we at? Where are we at? You know what? You know, we got to start thinking about what's going to be our next playthrough. We're kind of getting to the close, getting close to the end here of the Lizardman playthrough. And we got to kind of figure out where we're going to go next from here. Ambush foiled. The wild hunt begins. Ready for duty. So much plague. I hate it. All right. You go here because you are going to go here. I wish, man. Oh, let's go. look at that. Look at that. Poison wind mortars. All right, so before we move him in, I'm going to wait. Wait, Quahexla has... He does. Good, good, good. He has lightning strike. This is going to be... This is going to be nice. Yeah, move in just a little bit closer. Assassin, you got, you're moving the next turn. Nakai. Wait, where'd that army go? Wusses. Get in here. Oh. Nakai will take that next turn. Graw wall, full stack, ready to go. Graw wall, what you got, baby? Take him out. Nice. I could auto-resolve. I'm just going to siege it here. They're not going to come out after me because they definitely don't want to do that. That's going to be not good for them at all. All right, so we'll take them out, and then we'll be able to take our this whole area over here, taking it from the Skaven. I should have, darn, yep, I should have brought Assassin. I probably still will. Bring him down here and flank these settlements behind. How much does Skaven have left? They probably have a lot left, I'm guessing. 14. Yeah, oh my gosh. Where is where is 14 settlements? All up through here? I guess. Yeah, I guess. Jeez, 14 settlements, huh? Unbelievable. All right, so we'll wait here. Assassin, we'll wait there. You good. Uh, I'm going to go back and kind of assess the situation. And we're going to see where we're at. Oh. Oh. I look at you, Draz Hoeth. You little silly goose. You know, Draz Hoeth, if you come after me, that's not going to be good for you. Right? I mean, you have a ton of blunder. Oh, yeah. Oh, buddy, you definitely do not want to come after me. But I, I will fight you, so come here. I I will purposely get in fighting range, Drazhoeth, because that's how confident I am that your army will get absolutely shredded if you come after me. Bring it. Uh, a Rakatrow... You can go this way. Uh, heal. Move out a little bit more. Um, all right. So we're going to give, what, Dark Hold then to Emric. So diplomacy. Ally mission. I guess might as well accept that. Diplomacy. The power and the glory of Calador. Uh, what was that? What did I say? Dark Hold. Is that what it is? That is it. Yep. You know what? This will be must. Whatever. I've helped you more than enough. You should easily 
give me all of your money. All right, where are we at here? 21, still not better. Let's do this. Let's do that, just so we can try to get him on our side a little bit. You're you're going the wrong way. Uh, any quick deals that I need to know about? Oh, there we go. I'll take that. Okay, no. Uh, defensive with the warden's living pool. The dragon shall wake. Nope. Confederation. No. Okay, perfect. Uh, all right, you guys, we're going to leave it there, actually. We got a lot happening. I'm going to go back and kind of review and kind of see where we're at. We got to slow down a little bit because we are hurting for money now i don't know why or how or what is going on with our money situation uh i thought it was better than that but we're gonna have to see and we're gonna have to kind of assess reassess uh and go from there demon's gate is going to fall to nakai the wanderer graw wall will take a uh, bill valley i may yeah i'll probably take that next turn actually um to zeta you're going to probably fall back because you're not healing for crap right now so I might do, yeah, I can't get back into my, my territory. So I might move you back so you can heal a little bit quicker because that is absolutely garbage. Krokgar is going to fight Drazhoa because Drazhoa is going to get cocky and come over and try to attack me. Uh, Arakataral or whatever is going to take Bone Gulch next. Um, you, oh yeah, yeah, might as well just move you up here now. Perfect. Oxyadl trying to heal up. Let's go ahead and move you right outside the settlement. Heal. You're still not getting very much. Let's do this. Usually I get more healing out here, but then we're going to move in on Castle Splendor, Crucible of Delights, and then the Altar of the Facades. And then we'll probably give some of these settlements up. So uh, we got a lot going on, a lot happening. And the skull covers abode needs to be, get taken care of. Did they? Did they fight? Oh, they did. They beat back their army. Mm. Come on. Oh, there you go. Go after him. Are they going after him? I don't know. It's crazy. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, you guys. We will see you in the next one. And as always, remember, everything we do is in service to the great plan.